The Jimi Hendrix experience is over. The acid rock musician died today in a London hospital, apparently from an overdose of drugs. During his short career, Hendrix flailed his <clears throat> electric guitar into some of the most unusual sounds of an unusual music. A report now from ABC's Gregory Jackson. If you're much over 30, the odds are you never heard of Jimi Hendrix, or only dimly, perhaps a loud voice on the car radio. But take it for fact, in just the past four years, Jimi Hendrix became one of the best-known, highest-paid artists in recording history. An astonishing performer whose on-stage gyrations could make Elvis Presley look like a P.E. teacher. And it may well be that the story of Jimi Hendrix is a small picture of the overall explosive power and wealth of rock. The son of a Seattle gardener, James Marshall Hendrix quit school at 16, but before he was 20, he was touring the country as a backup guitarist for other rock groups. In 1966, a manager discovered him in a Greenwich Village bar, took him to Europe, formed a group, and just nine months later, Jimi Hendrix returned world famous. At rock festivals, Hendrix was paid $50,000 for a single performance. His album sold in the millions. He should have been a millionaire. It's not known whether he saved his money, but it is known that today, Jimi Hendrix is dead, an overdose. He was 28. This is Gregory Jackson, ABC News, New York. We'll be back in a moment.